Hey Pisces, thank you for checking out my channel for the love of water to row. It's your girl Keonti and I'm going to bring us a you versus them read. Again, this is going to be a you versus them read for the sign of Pisces, sun, moon, rising, and Venus, as well as the Pisces cross watchers. Hey baby sharks, how y'all doing? Guys, these, this is a general reading, so every last thing I say won't resonate for every last single one of you. Please make sure you're using your intuition and your discernment and putting yourself where you go in the energy, if you go there at all, okay? If I get it right for you, baby sharks, make sure you take care of your girl with the like, comment, subscribe, and the share. And if you guys are interested in booking me for a private reading, my email information will be provided in the description box below the video. All right, Pisces, I'm going to do us first. I'm going to going to tell us what I see going on with us, and then I'm going to do the them, your person, okay? I'm going to do us, you. And again, it could be reversed if you're if you're cross-watching, okay? I'm going to do us, then I'm going to do them, and then I'm going to pull some uh, additional messages for advice. And I'm also going to clarify with Tarot if you stick around. So let's see what's going on with the baby shark spirit. Tell me what's going on for Pisces right now. What's going on with Pisces? Okay. Oh, okay, 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 okay. Wait, 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 spirit, wait, 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 okay, okay. All right. Okay. All right. <laughs> All right. All right. Pisces, underneath the deck is last chances. So currently, Pisces, I feel like you. What's going on with you right now is you're coming up as this queen rising. You're, you're coming up as someone who is stepping into power. You could even be being praised and being in the spotlight. But I feel like more than anything, Pisces, your energy currently right now is stepping into power for sure. I feel like, Pisces, this is what you're on right now. And why you're on this kind of energy is because you're fed up. I feel like you are definitely in this energy of controlling the controllables, right? If it's something that you're not, you don't want to be bothered with, you don't want to hear, you don't see, if you're tired of, you're taking accountability and control of the things that you can control right why you're doing this is because of this boss daddy energy some of you are definitely dealing with the fire sign and aries in particular this is the emperor energy this is divine masculine energy so pisces you could be a pisces masculine energy i'm talking to you could be the feminine energy but the why in this situation is because of this boss daddy energy so pisces maybe some of you are just deciding to put your foot down right because the boss daddy is someone this is the emperor but this is also someone who is stable rich business owner ceo big big energy put it where it goes so pisces <clears throat> i feel like and, and 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 the how this is happening is dodging bullets so pisces i feel like currently you you and it's coming up as your energy Pisces. you are currently in the energy where you are taking power you're stepping into power you're getting you're, you're in this energy of trying to control the controllables i feel like you are definitely um in this energy this is not the deck i want to use you are definitely in this energy currently pisces where you are taking accountability you are feeling like you are i just feel like you're taking accountability you are taking control it is some things that you're fed up with no doubt about it pisces because i see it there are some energies that you're fed up with there's some things that you've been dealing with that you are now st st starting to feel more in control over you're feeling very powerful right now pisces i don't feel like i feel like you are definitely in this energy where you're not dodging or ducking or avoiding anything or anyone but you're definitely focused on being in control of the of the things that you can control. I feel like you're definitely in the energy. If you're letting, I do feel like you're letting people do what they want to do. Like you're with, with, with fed up. You're not um you're not injecting yourself into matters that don't have anything to do with you. Let me just say that. That's how I feel like you're acting right now. I feel like you're not in, you're not interjecting yourself. You're not overextending yourself. You're re you're really focused on your own ish, taking power and control of some things. And you could be doing this because of an emperor energy for sure. Mm -hmm. Let me get some more energy on you, Pisces, for what's going on with you right now. And then we're going to talk about them. Give me some for this queen rising energy for Pisces. Clarify the queen rising energy for Pisces. Because this is the energy you're in. I feel like you're definitely in this fiery energy here. Fed up. Pisces, I definitely feel like you're in a forward think. You're you're forward thinking right now. I do feel fed up and last chance under here. I feel like you're not revisiting some things here, but you're definitely feeling very much in control and in power. 
of your ish. And I like that. Give me some for dodging bullets here, spirit. For Pisces. This is what I'm seeing for you. Then we're going to start talking about your person. Whoever your person is, keep them in mind. Okay? All right. Underneath the deck here, what do I have? Ooh, apology and forgiveness. Ooh, we. Let's see why this is here, baby sharks. Let's go. All right. The queen rising. Ooh, we. Fed up. Ooh, we. All right. Pisces, I have you here. Queen rising was clarified with receive and open. Pisces, you are in some, you are like, you're, 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 you're a vibe right now. You are a vibe right now. Pisces, I feel like because you are this queen rising here, you are being, you are stepping in the power. You are being praised. You are in a, in a um, spotlight. Pisces, you're open to receive something here. You're getting ready to receive. The cards are telling me you're getting ready to receive and you're open for receiving something now, right? This is receptivity, opening up, generosity, gifts, assistance. Six of Pentacles. Pisces, you are about to receive. You are. And it has everything to do with your attitude, right? Because the Queen Rising is a vibe. She's someone who is stepping into power. She's she's being praised. She's coming up. She's being in the spotlight. She's in control. She's aware of her power and she's in control. You are definitely in the receiving energy, Pisces. You are, you are getting ready to receive something. Fed up was why you're in this power. Was clarified with the inner child and healing. Pisces, I do feel like a, a lot of this has a lot to do with you healing, right? Healing inner child wounds. Healing, healing your inner child. Healing wounds. Some of you are fed up with dealing with someone who needs to heal their own inner child and their own wounds, right? This is wounding, coping mechanisms, learned behavior, self-discovery. Yes, Pisces, I feel like you have done some self-discovery on yourself. But I also feel like, Pisces, you're not dealing with energies that has not, that has not dealt with their inner child, that is not healed, right? Pisces, you're definitely getting, like, I don't know. This feels really awesome. But this is what you're doing. And the why was the boss daddy, remember? Some of you definitely may have a partner coming in here because I have this masculine energy, very masculine with the boss daddy. And then we have Jupiter, action, inspired, risk, expansion, growth, pursuing passions, event, adventures, new opportunities, fortune. This is like an ace of wands here. So Pisces, some of you are definitely in this energy on your own, right? You're just in, like, I, you're the effing boss right now, Pisces. You're really on some boss-ish and I love it. I'm telling you, and you're on the right track. You may need someone to tell you this because maybe you don't know, but I'm telling you, I see this for a lot of you. A lot of you, you have this energy coming towards you, right? And it's, and it's all because you're in, because you're such a vibe right now, Pisces. You are a vibe right now for sure. So either you're doing this for yourself business-wise, for sure. You're getting ready to expand. There's this growth and you're doing this because of all this work that you've done on yourself. Or this is this is why this, I feel like you're already a vibe. But I feel like why you're a vibe, is so, th th this is coming towards you as well. For some of you, it's definitely. The dodging bullets energy was clarified with fulfillment. This is wish fulfillment. The nine of cups, success, achievements, happy outcome. Yes, Pisces, you got a happy outcome coming here because you're a vibe. You're in a receiving ass energy right now, Pisces, for sure. And a lot of you, I feel like it's because you minding your business. It's because you focusing on yourself. You controlling the controllables, Pisces. I do feel like there's a real energy of like doing some deep healing and kind of releasing some ish, right? And taking control over the things that you can control. Being in control of your own growth, your own expansion, healing yourself, right? I do feel like, Pisces, you have decided to... With dodging bullets, you decided to block some negativity, escape some crazy people, escape some crazy ish. I feel like some of you are fed up with some of this kind of wishy washy in and kind of energy here. So you are taking control of that, Pisces. You are in the receiving energy, Pisces. You a boss right now. But for some of you, I do see you've been this vibe. You've been this queen rising. You've been fed up. You've been doing this inner work. What you don't know is because you've done this, you got somebody coming towards you ready to be a counterpart. And it got everything what you do. It got everything to do with the inner work that you've been doing on yourself and blocking out some other ish. This is what I see you doing, Pisces. Now let's talk about your person, okay? Again, guys, make sure you take care of your girl with a like, comment, subscribe, and share if I'm getting it right for you, Pisces. Whatever you're doing, I'm loving it. It's coming up very good. 
I feel like you're definitely in, you're empowered, you're in control. You're not being bothered with BS. You're working on healing. I definitely feel like you're not dealing with childish ish. I got I got I got you I get I got you being open to receive. And I have some I have someone here, whether this is love or work or whatever it is, being able to give. Pisces, be sure to to talk uh, talk to God, pray however you do. Because I just heard asking you shall receive, Pisces. Whatever you're doing right now, you're doing the right thing. And if you ask, Pisces, whatever it is that you're asking for, you're going to receive it. Especially if this is resonating. Asking you shall receive, Pisces. Because I see that here. I see some of you have been praying and you've been asking, asking God. You've been talking to God about healing. You've been open to receiving some new things. You've been wanting to block out and get away from some, some patterns and also manifest some wish fulfillment for yourself in other areas, Pisces. I see you. I see you getting it. Asking you shall receive, Pisces. Let's talk about your person here. Spirit, let's see what's going on with Pisces person. Spirit, what's going on with Pisces person? This you versus them. Very interesting. So let's see. What's going on with them? Let's see what, what 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 kind of energy are they in right now. Okay, they got options. <laughs> okay, let's see what's this about here for Pisces person. Okay. 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 Okay, that's too many. Hold on, let me get it clean. <laughs> One more for them. I mean, I didn't even see this. Hold on, Pisces. Let me see. I want to get it clean. One more for the them. They're they're like flipping weirdly. Come on, give me one more for them. All right. All right. Underneath the deck, I have screenshots. So your person here, Pisces, I'm going to be honest with you. You could be dealing with the Gemini. You could be dealing with the Virgo. You could be dealing with an Aries. I feel like this them person here. Your person has a lot of people around them. I'm getting people, 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 people. I don't know what your person does. Your person feels very extroverted. Right? I do feel like your person, I don't know, your person deals with a lot. Listen, I, I got to tell you something. Your person doesn't lack attention. They don't. They don't. They get a lot of attention. They have options, Pisces. They do. They have options. There's other people that want to be with your person. There's, there certainly is. There's other people that want to be with them. But Pisces, I do feel like, and listen, I, like I said, I do feel like this person does get a lot of attention. I do feel like this person with idol. I feel like this person feels some sort of type of way about you. Because I feel like the who, it could definitely be a Gemini. The who is somebody who has options. But what's going on here is that they're looking at you. They're looking. That, first of all, they are being admired by people. But I do feel like they admire you too. And I feel like it's because of some sort of independence here. I have an emperor and an empress here, Pisces. And it's funny. The emperor is here in your energy. And then the empress is here in their energy. You see this couple? Power couple. Let me write this down. Because that, that's power couple energy for sure. Yeah, this is a power couple. Pisces, I feel like, and, and, and let me let me just tell you, show you what I got for them. I got the third, I got the love triangle. I have the idol. I have the boss bitch, and I have the ghost. Pisces, what I'm seeing here for your person, I think your person has no lack of attention. I think that there's, I think your, I think your person has gets a lot of attention. I feel like your person could be pulled in a lot of different directions. I feel like um, your person is well respected. They could even be idolized, right? But I feel like this person sees you as like someone who could be a power couple with them. There's power couple energy here, and you know what, Pisces? If this is if this is an old person, I'm gonna be honest with you. This was. This, this is the type of situation where it took for you to completely walk away and refocus and really work on yourself and heal and really focus on you. If this is an old person, this is what you did. And this is why someone is seeing you this way. If this is a, if this is an old person, this person, the ghost, this person is still around. Could definitely be a Virgo. If this is a new person, like I said, if this is a new person, 
this person definitely gets attention. This person is loved, idolized, and respected and praised. But it's something about your independence. Because the boss bitch is someone who runs their own business. Stable, busy, multifaceted. Pisces, you know what it feels like to me? Pisces, this person, this is this is somebody who you guys with the ghost. I feel like you you and this person don't get to spend a lot of time together. When you guys are together, it's like fleeting moments. It's like something about your presence lingers on this person. Yes, your presence is lingering on this person, Pisces. I also feel like this person could definitely also be in this energy where they adore you, Pisces. They really do, but they could be in the process of having to get out of something, disappearing. Yes, ghosting, in and out. It's either that or your presence lingers on this person. Whatever it is they got going on. I'm going to try to clarify and see whatever it's the guy they got going on. I'm going to see what else I get on this. So give me something for them. Why is the love triangle here? I do. If you could be dealing with a uh, Gemini, this person, this, I feel like this person is, is surrounded by people. This person gets pulled in a lot of directions. They do. Give me something for this love triangle energy for Pisces person. For them. And it doesn't have to be third party situations. This person could just like really be the kind of person where they, they, their their time is all they, they they don't have a lot of time because they do a lot of ish dealing with different people for sure. Give me some for this idol. Thank you, spirit. Ooh we the boss itch for Pisces person here. Clarify the energy of the boss bitch for Pisces person spirit. Boss bitch energy. Now they're getting quiet, Pisces. They don't want to tell me. <laughs> Woo wee. And the ghost. Okay. Yeah, I see why I was quiet. Okay. The ghost energy. Pisces, I also feel like I feel like your person is sitting back thinking about something. I feel like you said something that is linked. Either you left some sort of impression on them or you said something that's lingering that's still on their mind. Underneath the deck is guarded, guarded, vulnerable. Holding patterns. This is for this is for a pinnacle. So your person is holding back something here. All right, Pisces under the love triangle. I told you you could be dealing with a Gemini again, but I do feel like this person does have a lot going on. I feel like they're being pulled in a lot of different directions. But what uh, what, what clarified it was renewal, spark, new life, fresh start, ooh wee, rejuvenation, healing after a crisis. Sacral, sacral chakra. So listen, I feel like this person, Pisces, they may have a lot going on, but the cards are telling me that, that, that even though they have a lot going on, even though they have multiple choices and options, this person has some sort of spark for you. Now, I don't, and, and I do told you, it's not, it's no lack of attention for them either. Let me just say that. Ida was clarified with the world. This is new cycle. So, yes, I do feel like this is, for some of you, this is new or this is someone that's ready to go on some sort of new journey with you, Pisces. But, again, it has everything to do with what you've been doing that we talked about. The world, karmic completion, travel, fulfillment, achievement after obstacles, success. Okay. Okay, listen, I'm going to be honest with y'all. Some of y'all, this person, somebody in this situation could be newly single. I just got to be honest. This is this some of you this feels very new or newly single or some sort of restart with somebody like some sort of fresh new start here. But what idol in the world, I do see I Pisces, I feel like somebody does kind of idolize you. They see some potential in you. They they feel like this is somebody who feel like they they could see the world in you. And boss bitch for why this is happening has everything to do with uh decisions. So this person sees you as a potential power couple. I told you. And funny that they're in the same position here. Why? Power couple for the why. Pisces, your person does see you as somebody who, that, who can match their flight, but they got some decisions to make between two people or two paths. See? Contemplation. To stay or to go. Pisces, your person has some decisions to make. I do feel like your person wants the, the world is, is a cycle closing out. Renewal is about new ish. Yes. Pisces, I'm seeing a potential for a real power couple between you and somebody. But this person does this. They got some decisions to make. The card literally says between two people or two paths, contemplation to stay or to go. The ghost was clear. I regrets. Pisces, I feel like this person is hiding some regrets. 
They do. Now, if this person ghosted you in the past, they could regret it. I do feel like this person is lingering. It's something that's lingering about this situation. So, Pisces, if you are in separation with this person, you are lingering on their spirit for sure. Holding back, suffering in silence, block, blocking thoughts and memories. Pisces, if this is a new person, they definitely are hiding some regrets that they're feeling about some things from you. And I don't mean this in a necessarily nefarious, bad way, but they are. They are. They're holding back some regrets that they're having here. Well, this person could definitely regret ghosting you in the past. I have the four of pentacles under here, so they're guarded. There could be a situation dealing with money. There could definitely be, like I said, there's something that's wrapping up. This person has big decisions that they have to make, Pisces. They do. I feel like I'm very clear about what you've been doing, but I feel like I see what they've been doing as well. This video will go long. All right, baby sharks, I'm going to do some clarification with Tarot for us. Guys, make sure y'all take care of your girl with the like, comment, subscribe, and the share. Again, if you guys are interested in booking me, make sure that you email me. The information is in the description box below. I didn't expect for this to get so long in detail, but now I want to see what's going on with all of us. So let's just go ahead. I love, love, love y'all Pisces, and I thank y'all for always supporting me and, and uh, taking care of your girl. So let's get some clarification on you, and then we'll do them, and then I'll pull some um, advice for all, for all of us, okay? So give me some on this queen rising and receiving. Pisces, you, whatever you're doing, you're definitely in the energy of receiving, and I think you are fed up and inner child. Mm-hmm. Boss daddy and Jupiter. Mm-hmm. Fulfillment and dodging bullets here for Pisces. There we go. All right. Pisces. We ha I have the Page of Cups, the Seven of Wands, the Six of Cups, and the Chariot clarifying. And here's the Eight of Wands under the deck. Pisces, I do. With the Queen rising and receiving and the Page of Cups, Pisces, you are open to receiving. You know what? I feel like emotionally and some other ways, you're just in a better place right now. You're more in control of your emotions. You're more in, like, you're, you're definitely, you feel more, more empowered. You feel empowered. And I definitely feel like you're feeling strong and confident. You're in the energy of receiving. I feel like with the Page of Cups, you are receiving. This could be an apology, but this is emotions. This is, this is our, you, you are in the energy of receiving and you will ask and you shall receive Pisces. With fed up inner child and seven of wands, I definitely feel like, again, I feel like you're not being bothered with immature people or people who need to do inner work on themselves. Pisces, I definitely feel like you also got fed up with some sort of cycles within. So you be so you kind of shut down and did the work for sure on you, right? I feel like why you did this is because you felt like you needed to get control of some things, but I also feel like why why this is happening is because you're getting you have somebody that's getting ready to come in. For sure, for sure. If this is not you, because I have a power couple here. I do. I have the, the, the masculine energy on your side, the feminine over here on their side. This is a power couple. And I have a masculine energy, Boss Daddy Jupiter, with this take action energy with the Six of Cups. So you definitely have someone getting ready to take action and show you love and affection. I also feel like a lot of you are definitely... um very motivated and driven some of you are running your own business or you're very focused on your it is being very focused on doing something that you love putting a lot of energy and effort into your dream or something that you love or something that you're very passionate about pisces pisces i feel like you're blocking negative people and i and negative shit and, and and doing that is bringing you in wish fulfillment and it's also bringing in forward movement i also feel like because you're doing this there is something coming in for sure for some of you, if it's like a long-awaited message or something to that sort, I have two cards of moving under the deck, the Six of Swords and the Eight of Wands. So, Pisces, I do feel like a lot of this has to do with what you ask for. You ask to be in control. You you ask to feel powerful. You ask to, uh, to feel like you feel confident and strong. You ask God for that, and you also did some inner work asking you shall receive, Pisces. Something that you've been asking God for, you're getting ready to receive. But you did the work as well. You didn't just ask. What is that? Faith without works? Yes, you didn't just ask. You did things. And you're getting what you've been asking for, Pisces. I see this. I see forward movement. It could be coming from a water sign, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, or a fire sign. doesn't have to be any of that. Okay? Let's talk about them. Let's see what's going on with them. Pisces, I do see your person has... 
No lack of attention. No lack of energy. I do feel like, I don't know if it's people in love. It doesn't have to be like other and other lovers, but they do. They Their attention gets pulled in a lot of ways. They're sought after, but it is something new that they want. They want to close out some sort of cycle. They see a lot of potential in you. They know that they have some decisions to make because they see you as a potential power couple. They are hiding some regrets that they have here. They are. For some of you, if you are not in communication with this person, and you could definitely have this person blocked. Cause they, if you have this person blocked, because I could see the block here, Pisces, they want to communicate bad as hell. I got to tell you that they regret that they can't communicate. Others of you, this is just somebody kind of hiding their regrets, right? They're repressing them, right? They could definitely have some regrets about some ish that they're going to get ready to go ghost on, because I do see them wanting some new ish, and they know that they have a decision to make. Two people or two paths, they're contemplating. They're Pisces. So let's see what's going on with them. Give me one for the love triangle and, and renewal. I do feel like they want something new. I do. Yep. And there it is. Okay, the idol in the world. Pisces, I do feel like this person, this person could definitely love you, respect you, admire you, and be a fan of what you do. I do feel like they feel that with the world they want to close out some sort of cycle. They see some potential with you guys. Let me get one for the boss bitch and decision here for them. For Pisces. Oh, we, yes. Give me some for ghosts and regrets. Oh, we. All right, Pisces, underneath the deck for them is temperature. You could be dealing with a Sagittarius. But let me show you some Pisces. The love triangle, which is just multiple choices, options, and things like that, was, cl was clarified with renewal and the king of wands. Pisces, I told you this person is taking action. You could be dealing with the Aries Leo Sag, but this is the queen of wands, the queen rising, and here's the king. I told you I have a power couple. This person is ready for something new. They are. They want They want something new and they want something different and they are getting ready to take action. The world and the idol was clarified with the emperor and the magician. Power couple again. You could be dealing with the Aries, a Taurus, a Virgo, Gemini. Okay, I'll let you out in a second, pal. This person is ready to manifest something. And I also feel like they see potential in you, right? With the world and the magician, like we could really create something. Wait one second. For sure, Pisces. Now, look what, what look what happened with the boss bitch and the decisions, Pisces. We have the Ace of Cups. Now, you know the boss bitch is the Empress. Here's the Ace of Cups. I told you. This person knows that they have some decisions to make, Pisces, because I feel like someone sees you two as uh, two people that could be together and really make some sort of power couple, but they got a decision to make. They do have some things, some cycles that they got to close out, some things that they got to leave in the past, some things that they got to step up and do. The King of Wands and the Emperor is somebody who takes action. Pisces, the regrets, the regrets that they hide, right? The ghost and the regrets was clarified with the eight of pentacles. If this is an old person, they could regret that they didn't put energy and effort into something before, right? They could regret that they can't put, they, that they, they aren't able to put the energy and effort they would like to now, right? This could be someone that you work with. This, per, this person could watch you work. This could be someone, if you, if you have them blocked, they could be in separation, but they watch you work. But Pisces, I have this person here, the Emperor, the Empress, the Ace of Cups. They, this person, this is a power couple, and this person sees all the potential in the world And you, Pisces. I'm not going to say that they don't have other things going on, but they do. But the cards are telling me that they're ready to take action because they want something new. New life, fresh starts, rejuvenation, healing after a crisis. They could have recently went through one. The world is a new cycle, a karmic completion, travel. They could be at a distance, but fulfillment is here too. Achievement of obstacles after success. He just wants to cut up so bad. This person sees the potential with you, but they definitely know that they have some decisions to make if they want to come towards you and have something with you here, baby sharks. I'm going to get one for advice on you, one for advice on them. Guys, remember to take care of your girl with the like, comment, subscribe, and share. Give me one for Pisces, for Pisces advice here. Give me some advice for Pisces. Sky Father, trust the unknown. Mm -mm, you could be dealing with the air sign for sure. But Pisces, I do. I feel like this is like you getting um divine guidance. Mm-hmm. And I feel like this is what you're doing. I feel like I just feel like you're kind of leaning in. I told you, I definitely feel like you're very much in control. I feel like Pisces, whatever is coming towards you, you feel like you're in control. And I also feel like you may have somebody coming towards you and a very king of swords, empery energy that kind of wants you to kind of trust this person. If this per if this is resonating for you, this is probably a person that you can trust because I have stag, trust and thrive. I do feel like there's you can I, you can Pisces, you can best believe that you are getting ready to thrive. Trust that. 
trust the unknown because I feel like this is like direct messages from spirit telling you that you're doing the right thing. Spirit is guiding something towards you in a very good way. Asking you shall receive because you're about to get it, Pisces, for sure. Let's get some advice for your person here. Okay, that flipped right on. Trader, exchange energy to create abundance. I'm telling you, Pisces, I do feel like somebody is ready to do this. They are ready. They are ready to exchange energy and create abundance with you. Again, I do feel like they know that they, and this could definitely be a person that like is a trader. I don't know why I'm getting traveler, trader, day trader. But I do feel like this person is ready to do this with you. And underneath the deck, the high priest is harness your mystic powers. There we go, Pisces. Yes. Yes. I do feel like somebody is into it. They do. <laughs> They're into you. They feel like you may have mystic powers and that you guys could definitely have a power couple dynamic coming in. I do feel like somebody is getting ready to want you to trust them for sure. Could be a Sagittarius coming in. But someone is definitely ready to exchange energy and create abundance with you, Pisces. You'll just have to put yourself where you go. This is what they are thinking here. I love you guys. I appreciate you much, so much for entrusting me, believing me, booking me, supporting me, and allowing me the opportunities. I hope I brought you guys messages of peace, love, light, and clarity. Make sure you click on that link and the like button before you step out. And if you're interested in email, booking me, please email me. Stay beautiful, stay blessed, and stay high vibing. I'll messages for you soon, Pisces. Bye-bye.